North Korea and Russia, two countries teetering on the edge of diplomatic isolation for one reason or another, are attempting to make nice with one another. Looking to forge at least one friendly relationship on the international stage, Choi dong hye the special envoy for North Korean leader Kim Jong-un, held talks with Russian President Vladimir Putin in Moscow. Hwang seung yi has the details. North Korean leader Kim Jong-un's special envoy Choi ryong hye held an hour-long meeting with Russian President Vladimir Putin in Moscow on Tuesday. The Kremlin said Choi delivered a message from the young Kim, but provided no further details. Pundits say the possibility of arranging a summit between the two leaders could also be a part of Choi's mission. Russian Deputy Foreign Minister Sergei Ryabkov had told Russian news agency Itartas that the outlook for denuclearization of the Korean Peninsula would be the first subject taken up. Choi is being accompanied on his trip by North Korea's chief nuclear envoy Kim Gae-gwan. The North Korean delegation is scheduled to meet with Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov on Thursday before heading to the country's far eastern cities of Khabarovsk and Vladivostok to discuss trade and economic projects. North Korea is seeking further cooperation with Russia in the energy and agriculture sectors, while Moscow wants access to Pyongyang's natural resources worth an estimated $25 billion. This marks the third visit by a high-ranking North Korean official to Moscow this year. In October, Foreign Minister Ri Su-yong visited Russia for the first time in four years. Experts say these are part of Pyongyang's efforts to diversify its diplomatic partners as it finds itself on the outs with longtime ally China. Hwang Sang-hee, Arirang News.